Welcome back to Murphy's Diesel, folks. I'm Wrecker Rick, and boy, do we have a busy week. We actually got 15 days till the Wrecker Games, and I apologize, folks. You're probably not gonna see this video until we're at the Wrecker Games, so, because we're behind on videos. We have so much content, and we wanna keep it in, in order. Back to the busy week we got in front of us. So T minus 15 days till the Wrecker Games, folks. We gotta get Hellboy going. We got a new 379 Pete we gotta go pick up right now. And we blew the engine up in Phantom 309, so that was the truck we're taking to the Wrecker Games. Don't have that truck anymore, so Rowdy Wheeler's truck's got the engine blown up in it. Don't have that truck anymore. So we got a new one. We gotta go pick up our ranch truck, folks. That'll be another video down the road, and we're gonna call it Project Ranch Truck. So right now, we're just gonna call it Ranch Truck. So we're gonna go pick that up. You're gonna see everything that happens from now until the off-road game. So saddle up, folks, because it just might get Western. Got the custom-built TRX grill on there. Y'all didn't know this was a TRX, did you? So anyway, we're headed out. We're gonna go pick up the ranch truck. Mark's gonna work on Hellboy. So stand by, folks. All right, we're ranch truck bound, folks. Only 15 miles to go, folks. Stand by. Some wild jackasses over there, folks. Oh, y'all thought I was talking about De Niro. One wild jackass. Well, we made it, folks. Here she is, the ranch truck. Tell you what, she is a sight for sore eyes, folks. Off-road games, here we come. Huh? Huh? Everything you thought it'd be? Yeah. It's yep, you guessed it, folks. The old 6NZ cat. Looks like we got a little bit of rat problems. So we're going to have to redo some wiring on this, get this old dog fired up. And then, uh... We'll be back on the road again, folks. So, stand by. So we got some chewed up wires here, folks. We're gonna fix these, and we'll be back to town in no time. So we got a couple of chewed up wires in the engine bay we gotta fix. It should be good. It's been sitting for a while. So some pack rats have taken her over. That's got pressure on it. Purrs like a kitten, folks! Whoa! You do that? Start it up. Say it. Say it, Bob. 
We had a brake locked up, folks. Goal hammer, huh? Goal hammer trick. Here you go. And just like that, folks, the ranch truck is ready for the off-road games. Do you see that? Day two, folks. We're headed down to the desert to pick up some parts for Project Ranch Truck and Hellboy. Check out those hot air balloons, huh, folks? That's right, folks. We're coming down to ride a hot air balloon. No, just kidding. Uh, we're coming down. We got to pick up two fair leads for Hellboy. Go off-road, hook this up. So I called them Monday. They built us some fair leads, and we're going to pick them up right now. So, I mean, they got these things done in three days. Pretty amazing. And we're picking up some 8-inch stacks for project ranch truck so stand by cool cool check these out folks hellboy's new fair leads so we're here at go off road so if you guys need anything made down in the valley this is the place to go so they put these together for us in three days and super reasonable price so there you go. You said twelve hundred, right? Yep. Okay. Uh, that's fifteen hundred. Because I appreciate you guys. And well, thank you very much. Yes, sir. I was going to say when I heard you counting them off, it sounded wrong. So I was like, yeah. "Well, yeah, Rick, no, absolutely it, a pleasure." You guys are a lifesaver. So. Oh my God! <laughs> are you kidding? Make it look easy. Oh my God! Look at that. Would you look at that, folks? God, it was so easy when they went in. <laughs> God dang. Talk about precision, folks. I gotta fix it. Look at that, folks. Oh yeah, those are all. Yeah. Day three, folks. Uh, we are just about done with this old dog. It's fixing to go to paint. Let me tell you what. Look at the grill on the TRX, world's largest TRX, folks. <whistles> Got our KC's mounted, folks. Our headlights. She is ready. I mean, almost ready. Bring her on down. Oh, snap. Look at that, folks. All right, Rut, keep coming. Come on down. Go down. Keep coming. Keep coming. It's got pushing into the bed. Huh? It's already pushing into the bed. It's pushing the tank down into the bed. It's going to crunch it. Pick up. Up. Go all the way. Down, down, down. Down, down, down. Keep coming, keep coming, keep coming. All right, all right, bring it up. Perfect. And perfect shape to the boom. I don't know if you noticed, but the hydraulics are working on Hellboy, so blammo. Somebody run the air compressor and let's see if that dent's gonna pop back out. Hopefully not, huh? Well, that didn't work, folks. It's pretty much round again, so. 
just as I suspected. But, but those sure look good. All right, folks, it's day four, and De Niro is stuck in the snow this morning. Been stuck since yesterday. So we got to run and grab him to Wendy, son of a buck, this morning. Wendy, you're a well digger's asshole. Got Rob, my main man, with me, and let me tell you, he is dressed to kill, folks. Pretty sharp. All right, let's do it, huh? Shut this door. Hold on to the speed demon. Ooh, snap. There she goes. Yeah. <laughs> you just went back to sleep. <laughs> well, he's got an axe out here. Tried to take his life with, a, with an axe. You get yeah. tuned up last night or what? Well, we found him, folks. What were you doing with that axe? Trying to cut your wrists? Too many Fontas. Just as I suspected. What do you have to say for yourself? I don't know. Huh. Smells like a Fanta brewery in there. What are we doing? Why'd you break up with your girlfriend? How much snow, how much air you got in your tires? Uh, quite a bit. Here, let's let some air up. Uh, there you go. Oh boy. You got back up to him. Oh, oh yeah, yeah, why well, <laughs> pulled him that way, remember? Yeah, there you go. <laughs> Whoa, whoa! Hold on. Let me switch the rigging. All right, so we needed to come over this way, so we had to hook it to the other side. Now, Hot Rod's gonna hammer on it. Try to stay left as much as possible. All right, you're good. Just like that. Another satisfied customer, folks. Are you satisfied, De Niro? Yeah. He parked his truck, folks, and got drunk off of Fontas. Dude, Too I'm many Fontas. He had the biggest sugar high you've ever seen. And he just I'm drove his truck off in that snowy mess. The road was bladed all the way to here, so I'm assuming somebody got stuck right there and then they hired somebody with a piece of equipment to come get him out. So they just bladed the road in here and got him out. Folks, all you gotta do is call Murphy's Diesel. We don't have to blade the road to get you out. You don't need to do all that nonsense because they had to blade the road for probably 15 miles. All right, folks, day five. In the shop, working on Hellboy, working on the ranch truck. And I got this little gem in. You all still think Cowboy's not going to have enough power? Huh? Thanks. All you Ford lovers out there? Cowboy's getting on the juice, folks. Cowboy's not natty anymore. 
This video is sponsored by Nitrous Outlet today, folks. No, I'm just kidding. Not really. This, I just typed in nitrous and this is what came up. Uh, I don't even know if they're any good, folks. Got a cool little deal that goes in the coin holder of Hellboy, though. What does that say? Huh? Purge. It says purge. Arm heater open. Opener. Opener. Does that, that bottle come full or do you have to... Ranch truck just got some new tail lights, folks. Mud flap hangers. It's DOT week, so we want to be on the up and up when we head to Sand Hollow. Day, and I've lost count, folks. I'm not sure. I forgot. I lost count. I've been working like a rented mule. We all have. Isn't that right, Michael? Yep. Trying to get her all shiny, but it's going to take a little more work. Getting the visor on there. Building a custom visor. Just big enough where you can lower your head and see under it. Getting a bumper built. And better back up a little. Ranch truck bumper. Getting Hellboy done. Just about done with Hellboy. Got our clevis mounts on. De Niro slapping one of the anchor fair leads on. Got the brackets done for the sling. Clevis holders, clevis mounts. Getting these reservoirs mounted up. Boy, she's ready. Got lights on the boom. All she needs is four winch lines now, folks. Got the nitrous hooked up. Nitrous on a wrecker. What do you think about nitrous on a wrecker? Got our steps mounted. Nitrous and stirrups on a wrecker, folks. Yeah. Uh, where's those winch lines? Can I help you? What'd you say they would be? There's, they're in the side of the Dodge flatbed oh, and in the side of the International. They're red. Do we have fair leads for a no, uh, Yankum's supposed to get us some, so. Uh, we still gotta weigh this some buck. Don't get hung up. Bring it up with you on your toe suit. Perfect, that is badass. Yeah, that's why you want the Oxbow's folks, so you can bring it up with you. So you don't have to reach down and pick it up. I guarantee you, Dodge is gonna start doing that on their trucks. Dodge, Ford, and Chevy, guarantee you, that you'll see them with stirrups now. Like that works better than a step. Show us again how you brought it up with you. I don't know if I can do that again. Yeah, sure you can. Keep it keep it on your foot and get out like a Just like that, folks. Just walked in the door and bam, got a got an off-road recovery. So, ah, boy, when it rains, it pours. So, guess at least it ain't a rollover on the highway. Huh? So, go have a little fun and uh, Gladys the Gladiator, T Money's Jeep.
So I didn't feel like going all the way to Ash Fork and picking up my track truck or Hellboy because Hellboy is actually doing recoveries now. Uh, because literally right here, about 20 miles from my house, down the back road, and I don't really, and it's almost dark, so. Buckle up, folks. It's the law. Click it or ticket. I got my one and only love of my life with me. Mrs. Wrecker Rick. The one and only Mrs. Wrecker Rick. I got my original Wrecker Rick because that's what I've been using here lately. Uh, the last couple, well, this would be the second recovery I used with it. But uh, wait till you guys see this thing. It is, you know, man, it's got a lot of recoveries on it. Rod's got it. Got to stop by his house. I literally don't have any recovery gear except for brand new Wrecker Rick rope kits that I want you guys to buy. So I'm not going to use another one of those because I keep every time I have to do a recovery I'm at home I break one out and I've got like 30 of them right now in Hellboy. So. Glass has 37 on. It's got tons of clearance. They just don't have any lockers, bead locks. I might air the, air the tires down there. So if you could tell me when this front left gets down to 8 psi, 10 psi, front okay. left. Right, you got it. You got it. You got it. Got her air down, folks. So another 20 miles to go. Winch bumper without a winch. How about that, folks? Boy, it sure looks cool. Hold on, babe. Stand, stand pretty far back, babe. I'm gonna have to hit this thing. Okay. Maybe a little bit more. Yeah. A little bit more. Okay. Woo, that was deep though. Thing did not want to come out yeah, for sure. Yeah, yeah. And the mud is just so deep. It's his father's mud. Yeah. Aww, no fair. <laughs> <laughs> That's why I was moving all of her stuff. I was uh, <laughs> like, yeah. Making our 17 year old sure. daughter. Mm -hmm. That's not her car shoot. That's our car shoot. Yeah. <laughs> oh, I see. That's her toting her little mm. sister's around. Yeah. All right, we'll see you down there. You got it. Round two, folks. Stuck in snow. Here you go. Well, folks, we got three days till the record games, and we have got Hellboy done, folks.
We're just taking it down to Phoenix to get some new vinyls put on it, and then we're headed to Utah, folks. So stand by. We got the ranch truck going. Had to take them old leaking stacks off of it, threw a bumper on it, hand built by yours truly. Visor, how about that? You ever seen a custom built visor, folks? Now you have. Let's see if this old dog will start this morning, huh? Boy, she purrs like a kid, huh? We're gonna get this old dog cranked down, huh? How about that skid plate, folks? And for all you haters out there saying Hellboy doesn't have a skid plate. Got winch lines on there, got our Yank and Bear leads on there. Got all of our Casey highlights on there. Got Casey highlights everywhere. It's the world's first mega TRX, folks. Well, folks, we made it down here to Arizona Color Vehicle Wraps. So if you need a wrap, go talk to these guys. But you'll have to come to Phoenix to get it done. It's the only thing that sucks. How about that exhaust tip, folks? We were going to put a stack on it, but... Couldn't figure out how, so... Uh, Put a little exhaust box right there. I think it's pretty dope, so. Look everyone, it's Mad Dog. Mad Dog's getting geared up to head to Sand Hollow, folks. We nitrous injected Hellboy, Mad Dog. So it's got a little red button you push to give the red dragon a little bit more juice. We've never tried the nitrous, folks. Shot's gonna be in the competition, so hopefully she holds together. If not, y'all, y'all get a show either way, huh? If it blows the head off of that 6.7 liter Cummins, then that's a pretty good show. If it don't blow the head off of it and the truck just goes, it's a pretty good show. It's a win-win, right? Ain't that right, De Niro? That's right. We rolled up in here, and all of our trucks are dirty. Two hours late, and they they jumped on it. Start cleaning, start peeling. We we're supposed to have the old decals off. They peeled the old decals off. <coughs> cleaned our trucks for us. It's a real class act, folks. They've wrapped our rotators too. Martin Riggs got wrapped here twice. They do. They do a bang up job, folks. Be sure and check them out. Get yourself a wrap job. Are you folks ready for the off-road games? Three more days. I see somebody get their ass kicked and it ain't gonna be me. What do you mean? Well, obviously we're not having a fist fight out there. I mean, like, competition-wise. Like, I'm not threatening nobody, I'm just saying. Looks pretty sharp, folks.
So Yankum said, hey, we need to wait on your wrecker. They asked me like three weeks ago, but we'll go ahead and do it today. We're, you know, it's been busy around here, folks. I've been running around like a chicken with my head cut off. Now this is literally the final day. We're leaving tomorrow morning, folks, heading for San Hollow. So. Okay, now we'll just hook these two. To that one shot. Yeah. Miller for you, folks. Miller Industries for it, huh? All right, folks, so Matt's off-road called and Yankum called and said, hey, we need a wait. So we're getting a wait. And that's our scale right there. So stand by while we get a wait, folks. Anybody want to guess? Anybody want to take a wild guess? Are we doing that? Did we do a guessing? Did we Did we do a challenge? We did a weigh-in challenge. challenge? Uh, I guess we forgot to do a challenge. So, so I'll tell you what we're going to do, folks, is we're going to give merch to five lucky winners we'll do a folks counter tell me how many times i said folks in this video and the first five people that guess the right answer they get themselves some merch so just like that 14.8 thousand folks right there proof is in the pudding All right, folks, so one last thing I gotta do before we go. Well, a couple of things I gotta do before we go. Uh, what I'm doing is I'm building a light bar for my new Slim Light 8s, folks, from Casey Highlights. They just came out with them. Let me tell you, they're badass. So that's what I'm doing, these guys, these guys are loading up the welding rig. They're getting our service truck ready to go in case anything breaks on Hellboy or anything breaks on the ranch truck or Black Betty or anything. We we're, take a service truck, a heavy duty service truck. It's got welder, welding rig, service truck, air compressor, all kinds of tools, torches, all that stuff, pipe bender, uh, you know, soft serve ice cream, See, check out the new Slim Light 8s, folks. Pretty legit. Check out those Casey highlights. It's nice. I know the light the light package on my rotator was like eighty thousand dollars or something like that. Really? Yeah. Yeah, the light package on my rotator. Something stupid. Dude. Just a shade under a hundred grand. You could do it on KC, huh? Yeah, we'll start putting KCs on there. Those are legit. I got right. You can see the side of the peat like daylight. Alright. Hey, Look at that good looking ranch truck, folks. Why are you all doing the first Why are you doing Hellboy, the Mega TRX wrecker, off-road, world's largest. How are we doing? Yeah, why, without Wh me? Why are you doing the Mega Hellboy's, Hellboy, the Mega TRX, world's largest off-road wrecker, world's first Mega TRX, first pick without me? Because we're on a tight schedule. Well, that's a tongue twister. All right, let's 
Builder up. It's a. Uh, it's like Tuesday morning, and we're trying to get packed up and get ready to go. But nobody's here yet besides me and Treg, so stay tuned. folks last day it's it's mope day got a big old wreck out on the highway last night great just ruined this like the Well, folks, we're loaded up. We just got to chain her down, and we're going to hit the road. Hit the road, folks. Uh, looks like we got everything. Got service truck. Welding rig. Hellboy. Black belly. Let's check out this new bumper we slapped together for Casey Highlights. I do like how they hug the grill though. Not a stack, but it's still kind of cool, huh? Spikes on. Spikes engaged. War machines going, what? We are trucking. We are Utah bound. I'm in the old ranch truck and heavy T's in the war machine, 75 ton rotator, crowbars in the off road service truck. This is Wrecker Ricks in her pickup. She's got the merch trailer on behind us. And we are Utah bound, folks, so stand by. See a little Utah action. How about them Jakes? Nothing like eight inch stacks, huh?
Well, it's all still on there. I guess we strapped it down, right? Say hi, Smoke. Hey. Hi, guys. So, guys, my road trip. Detroit. I was pain in the pain in the. You know, he was a pain. But. Basically, Detroit was um, causing a ruckus, and then I tied him to the seat, and then he chewed through his leash. So now he's in the very back. So yeah, that's what we got going on in here. We're gonna turn on our bangers once again, and get to jamming because I'm pretty sure we still have like two more hours. <laughs> TTYL! The way I feel Man, I feel like a woman Murphy's Diesel is officially in Utah! Yay! <laughs> well, we rolled in here last night, folks. Made it to San Hollow. So, we're gonna go over to the get our booth set up and then we got to meet over at Mischief Makers I guess is what it's called to sign in but the old 6NZ ran pretty good folks Long why don't you introduce the folks to your new baby yeah. and Wrecker Jr. Wrecker 357 Jr. Three, 379 Junior. <laughs> well, who's senior then? I guess it's not Junior, it's just Wrecker. Wrecker's 379. It's his full legal name. It's really weird. I just opened yeah, up that box and I got <laughs> <laughs> What do you have to say, babe? I'm ready. For what? I'm ready to watch Hellboy kick everybody's ass. Oh, I'm not dead. Oh, my Lord. There it is, folks. We're just across the lake from it. We're fixing a head over there. Let's get the old ranch truck fired up, folks. Thank <laughs> you. 